They took the little girl out and they left me in the van. Um, I could hear a lot of commotion that was going on outside. People that were, were screaming and, and yelling and, and uh, this low murmuring and a moaning noise that was going on, like some kind of a low chanting noise that was going on. So I knew in my mind there was some type yeah. of a ritual going on because I'd heard that many times before. Yeah, rest of the year we'll fill with splendor. Little baby shooting arrows started off in the dead of winter. Right after pedophiles had little boys for Christmas that sat on their lap and asked them for toys for Christmas. Disguise a day for fathers, another day for mothers. Make it look real good. How about a day for lovers? Bunny rabbits, Easter egg hunts, wearing colorful outfits after missing church for months to celebrate this hidden sedition with wicked origin. But didn't hold nothing back with a certain Celtic tradition. Pagans and Wiccans, bunch of different ways to say Satanists. Some don't want to choose, get them to call them atheists. But nobody's offended until you say, hey, hey, the creator of Earth, he gave us holy days. Now they're like, hold on, now they've been opposed on. Space been encroached on. Man, this world long gone. You know, it was real common to see people fall on the ground and, and go into convulsions during the rituals and stuff with the demonic presence that were around. And uh, finally, a woman came to the back of the van and she said, it's time to go. And I could see that there was just a lot of people around. Some were dressed in uh, dark brownish kind of robes with hoods over them. They took me up and they led me up to this stone altar. But this day we'll play no games. We ain't disguising nothing. We having witches and fire flames. Scary jack of lanterns. Everybody cut your pumpkins up. Then pass out candy to children that come running up. That way we know they gon' participate. What kid won't cry for some candy? And what parent won't alleviate? And they've been coming up, missing all year. To be the main meal for days like this right here. Halloween, a night of all out wickedness. They finish it, drinking on the blood of the innocent. Tied to an altar, getting bled like a pig. Lick your child off their fingertips, baby back ribs. And uh, I remember I saw the little girl and she was on the altar. Now at first, you know, I, I just wondered what was going on because you never knew. I mean, they used the altar for a lot of different things. They could have just been sacrificing an animal over. Could have been a sexual abuse from the high priest on to her you know it was a hard thing to, to know for sure well they finally they ushered me up to the altar and I could see that they had bound her feet they had her feet spread apart her legs and they had bound them to the ends of the altar and they had taken her arms which were laying out this way and roped them to the altar and she was really white just I, I, I remember seeing her and she was just real pale and real white and I noticed that they had slit the bottoms of her feet and her wrists and they were taking the blood that was running out of those areas and putting them into chalices and passing those cups around to different people who were partaking of her blood. Then the, the high priest, he took the athami or the ritual knife and he picked it up and he put my hand on it and then he forced it into her chest. So when I think back on Halloween, you know, over that period of time that happened, you know, that was the climax event, Halloween night, where they, they killed that innocent little girl. And this is something that's happening every Halloween. That's not just an isolated event. I mean, there are children all over the world who are losing their lives during Halloween night. And yet we, as a society, we go out and celebrate it. And we go door to door and we ask for candy and it's a, it's a big celebration to us. And I think it's quite ironic how one group of people are thinking it's fun and another group of people are taking human life. And yet they don't, you know, there seems to be this wall and nobody wants to face the facts of what's really going on. Nah, that ain't good enough. Hold on, come back at it. Oh, give it uh, that's not good enough. Make a plan. More children turn up missing this time of year than any time of the year. Usually around this time or around near Christmas because they really need some pure innocent blood to drink and it usually is young children. They're killing 12 midnight on around Halloween. The time they claim that the dead comes to this earth. That a door is open from hell and the dead walk amongst men. Uh, I'm up.
It's show horror story this year. Whole bunch of Israelites woke this field. It's only for the most higher hopes. Ask them what happened the day of atonement. Demons was getting starved out, moaning and groaning. It's a nightmare on your street. Four deep, no heat. Cold sheet of straight facts. Everybody gon' see that says Ray ain't the true image of Christ. And that the transatlantic slave trade was prophesied. No dark hoods, William all white. Get up a graveyard and it's crawling with the living dead. Busting out they coffins. He the mic lady tried to run and forsake all. Tripped over her own feet. You know how. They fall. Caught a couple kissing at a state park. Slaughtered their religion, sent them spinning off in their car. Marvel, not a how you got this. Stay calm. Blowing up the spot. Napalm. Yeah, we know about your child sacrifice. A cold practice you picked up from Canaanites. Wanna buy for some apples? How you like these? Hip to the tricks, turning down your trees. And we don't hollow no wings. We don't hollow nothing but the most high. We don't hollow no wind. Yeah. We don't hollow nothing but the most high. Come on. Verse 5. And also those merciless murderers of children. Ooh, look at that. You see why they took this out of the Bible? Part of the practices of the Canaanites were their merciless murdering of children. Their whole thing is aimed towards destroying the children. That's paganism. See? Come on. But the court should ignore us and not listen You won't care until it's your child missing It's still in the fear of demons in your child heart They ain't scared of the most high But they terrified of the dark Follow not the way of the heathen My children is fringed up Never been trick or treating And ain't keeping Nothing but the feast days of Shabbat A costume for what? Stop trying to be what you're not Been Cleopatra the Nefertiti All the Egyptians white Why it's hard to believe They switched out the Israelites, looking at you watching, it's about that time To go looking for your child that you ain't never gonna find Cause they down in some basement, molested and murdered About to get ground up and served back to you as a hamburger I ain't lying, do the research By the same people you was taught as God's chosen people of the earth Yeah, we know about your child sacrifice A cold practice you picked up from Canaanites Wanna buy for some apples, how you like these? Hip to the tricks, turning down your trees And we don't hollow no wings We don't hollow nothing but the most high We don't hollow no wings We don't hollow nothing but the most high Back from the dead and they can't understand this We don't hollow nothing but the most high Fear the most high and keep his commandments and also those merciless murderers of children and devourers of man's flesh and devourers of man's flesh and the feast of blood with their priests out of the midst of their idolatrous crew and the parents that killed with their own hands souls destitute of help mm, souls destitute of help children screaming for mercy and help are given to these satanic evil priests to be sacrificed like nothing on altars. On altars. Hey, hey, hey. It's allowed in America. In America. Come. Second Nature's 2 and 29 through 31. My hand shall cover thee, so that thy children shall not see hell. 30. Be joyful, O thou mother, with thy children. For I will deliver thee, say of the Most High, thy power will hide. 31. Remember thy children that sleep, for I shall bring them out of the sides of the earth and shew mercy unto them, for I am merciful, say of thy power almighty.